Okay, so just uh, if you can while we're doing feel the feelings, keep your uh, keep um, try and keep your back straight if you can while doing the feel the feelings. If you start to feel like you want to go to sleep, you can also do the feelings on going to sleep, but still try and keep your back straight rather than doze off during doing this um, because any energy or any feeling which is arising um, can be experienced out. So the way to do it is just to locate, just to uh, locate uh, any energies that have been experienced. So you may have feelings in the stomach uh, and those feelings could be whatever it is or it could be a, uh, an emotion like guilt, funny stomach, it could, it could be tension in the chest, or there could be um, strong feelings in the heart area, whatever it is that's being felt. But remember, just allow that to be to, to arise. To understand that when you resist, when you resist something, uh, or if you try and push it down, uh, you can get rid of it. But th that's the opposite of what we're trying to do. We're trying to allow everything to come up and be experienced and released. So if you try and push it back down again. Um, even if um, even if you, you burst out in crying or anything, that's okay. But just let it come out. Try not to. Now the thing is, as these feelings, as you as you allow these feelings to come up and be experienced fully, just allow them to be, and and you're letting go of the story or the labeling that goes around whenever this, whatever is going. And remember, it's not even a feeling. It's uh, energy. It's not even an energy. It's a vibration. You don't even need to let go, you don't even need to label it as a vibration. Just allow it to be. Now, if you let go of the thoughts, as soon as you're in the energy, just allow the energy, just fully welcome it. And as soon as a thought arises to make a story or distract into something else, just disengage from that thought and just be back with the energy. And if another thought arises in consciousness, um, to, you know, you need to do the shopping or just disconnect from that thought as soon as it arises and back with the energy. And as you allow the energy, it will start to dissolve. And, as an, and thoughts will try and pop up into stories, just detach from those and just be with it. Understand that when you allow these energies to be uh, and you disengage from the thoughts, you are not feeling the feeling. Because you, be, you have to be in thought to experience that there's a you. If you disengage from thoughts, actually it's the universe which is, al which is allowing those energies and will deal with it. As soon as you identify with the thought, the idea of a you having to deal with it arises. So as soon as a thought arises, drop the thought and then you'll be allowing the universe to deal with the energy, not you dealing with the energy. As soon as you touch a thought, it, it starts to be experienced like, I can't handle this, I don't want this to come out but detach from those thoughts. Understand that as soon as you touch thought, the power of labels is very, is very strong. As soon as you touch a thought with a medical condition, as soon as you put a label onto it, it has the power to push that energy into form. So just disconnect from any thoughts, just disconnect from the thoughts, labels, diagnoses, and have the attitude of more or allowing, let go of all repression. It's okay in this room to have any kind of noises or, f or feelings coming up, just fully allow it. This is a safe place, fully allow it, just let more of it come up. Even if you have the thought it'll be unbearable or you fall to pieces, just let it all come up. This is a safe space, this is what this space is for. Don't push anything back. And we're going to, and as these evaporate or they become more intense, remember, don't back down. Just let it come up fully. Don't back down and it will eventually pass. And if something else comes, just let that come up. Let everything come up and disengage from the thoughts. Eventually, as you become good at it, you'll get to oneness. Remember, it's the resistance, the not wanting it, that prolongs the pain. It's the trying to push it away that represses the pain 
and, and, and pushes it away for another day until it gets stronger. So what we're going to do is we're going to do about uh, 10, 10 or 15 minutes of doing this and just let it come up and then uh, we'll see how we do. So we're going to go into silence.